Hey guys, it's Nicole and my husband just brought in a new magazine. So I'm going to do a magazine harvest because I need more stuff. <laughs> don't we all? Uh, I really don't need more stuff, but I do at the same time. You know what I'm saying? Um, this is August 2020, Better Homes and Gardens. And my husband was excited to give it to me because it's all about melons and I love melon. I am... Normally, I don't cut out images from the cover because it's too thick, but Better Homes and Garden Magazine has extremely thin paper. It's like pathetically thin. So I, I am going to take this off because I want to keep it cool. I'm going to cut that out. All right, let's get started. See how this is like tissue paper practically. I am going to rip this out because it says bright ideas and I want that am I in frame yes yes I am okay what else so many panty liner ads I'm gonna cut this out because I want road trip Okay, well, I guess I'm not cutting it out. I'm ripping it out. And that just ripped that page, so that was fun. I'm also looking for words that I like because um, I'm always looking for new words. Let's see. I think I will rip this out for the three little flowers that are down here. Let's see if I can do it without ripping the other page. I'm going to rip this out because it says you can't fake delicious. It's on the waste knot. I'll probably end up cutting this dog out as well. Okay. You know what? These are bothering me already. Let's just put those up there or something. All right. I'm going to rip this out because I really love the color of all of this. Mind your rind. <laughs> That's funny. Maybe I'll cut out the jelly. Thank you guys for putting up. I just wanted to have a quick little disclaimer. Um, with my webcam issues, I have decided to return that webcam and my husband ordered me a very nice webcam last night. So we will have no more problems as soon as that gets here which should be Thursday. Okay, so I'm super excited for that. Um, I think I'm going to rip this out for the circle here and the circle here and the word animal. Been going to make some more master boards today and I want to add some circles to it. I'm going to rip this out for the word yikes. These dogs are pretty funny. Oh, but I like this too. Getting your kid to clean. I think I can get, I can get both. If I play it right, I can get the word yikes and I can get this, this kid cleaning. I'm going to rip this out for breaking through barriers. And I'm going to rip this out because I want his eyes. I've been really in, into putting human eyes on animals lately. I mean, I've always been into that, but like lately I'm really into that. Okay. I do like this. We are better together getting through this together. Do I want the word together? I have that a lot, actually. I've been. No, oh, I do like this. Spreading goodness. And I'll cut out her eyeball, too. That's a win win. Wow, kind of finding a lot here. Either I'm finding a lot or I've lowered my standards. I don't know. Oh, ripping this out. Need a timeout? Yes, yes I do. I always need a timeout. 
Um, do I want the word care? Yes. I'm going to rip this out for the word care. And I might cut her out too. Let's see. Ooh, I love all this blue. I think I will... Do I want to put... No, I don't want that. I'm going to rip this out for today and the word snack and boulder. Maybe even little. Maybe going gray. Yep. Fill them back up. Fill in my words. Stay. So this is cool. The Bed Bath & Beyond has all the little squares. So I'm going to take this out. I'll probably rip or cut out quite a few of these little squares. Nothing on the back. And another poise. All right. How many maxi pad ads can we have? I'm going to rip this out because there's lots of words here. And eye roll. I keep ripping that out because these panty liner ads give me an eye roll. Yes, I get it. They're for women. It's a women demographic magazine, but whatever. Um, I want the word smart and I want the word mom. How these magazines are so thin. Oh, I think... I think I can't speak because that was like three words in one. Um, I think I'm going to cut out the eyes of this animal and put it on a human. Oh, yes. I want this cat in my life. Um, my son, youngest son, and I want another cat really bad. I had my cat, oldest cat died last year. I had two cats that were sisters but a year apart. One, la one lived 13 years and one lived 16 years. And the one that was 16 was like my baby. Um, but this is the kind of cat I want to get next. And I love this grumpy faced little kitty a lot. I don't even care what's on the back because I just want that cat. Jackson would want that cat too. Um, let's see. What else do I want that skateboarder? I do want the word under control. Technically that's two words. So I will possibly cut out that skateboarder too, depending on how I feel that day. What else? Hmm, I kind of like that I did it, but this is not a bed. It sure looks like a bed. If it looks like a bed and it seems like a bed, maybe it's not a bed. What she did. I want that because you all know where I'm going with that. Stop mask breath. <laughs> what? Have we gotten there now? We have ads to make our breath smell better. for. So it was okay to have nasty breath and let everybody suffer from your nasty breath before. But now that you're wearing a mask and you smell your own breath, we need to do something about it. So stop your mask breath. I need to save this. This is ridiculous. That is the dumbest thing I've ever heard. I mean, I get it. Why don't you just brush your teeth and use mouthwash and continue off with on with your oral care so the rest of us don't have to smell your nasty breath okay this is the third one yep i want the cat eyes i want the cat eyes Ooh, yummy minus the cheese eat in peace for once I'm a mom. That's never going to happen. <gasps> Watermelon berry basil blend. Cantaloupe peach. Agua fresca. Honeydew ginger lime fizz. All the above, please. All the above. 
made with 100% real Oreo cookies, not pretend Oreo cookies. How would we even know the difference? It's all ground up. To salt or not to salt? That is the question. Do you salt your melon? I do not. My boyfriend in high school, my senior year, um, his family put salt on their watermelon and he brought it down. We were all watching a family movie together in another language, his nationality, so I didn't understand a thing that was going on. And she brought watermelon and I'm like, ooh, yeah, I'm gonna eat this because I love melon. Took a bite and took everything I had not to spit it out because that would have been rude. She put salt on it and I'm like, no, mm-mm, gross, can't do it. These look tasty, little homemade cream danishes. Do these have tomatoes on them? I think those are tomatoes. Interesting. Interesting. Chickpea salad with tuna. You had me until you said the word tuna. S'mores. Trudy, if you're watching, this is a s'more. Remember when you were asking the other day what that is? There you go. Graham cracker, marshmallow, which you don't like, so you won't want to eat this anyways, and chocolate. All together better. I will take that. I'll cut out the word love as well. Okay, let's see what else do we have. Um, eh, I was going to cut out family, but who needs it? Just joking. Don't come for me. Hmm. I like some of these little squares on the wall. So I'm going to rip those out. What's on the back? Nothing. Maybe I'll keep this C. What else do we have here? Ooh, look at this house. Oh my goodness. Look at that hammock. Oh, and this porch. Yes, please. Want it. I want it now, father. What movie is that from? Time to brine. I kind of like this picture with all the jars. It's colorful and fun. Rip. And I kind of like this one with the beets. Let us turn up the beets. I'm an idiot. Okay, just as much is said on the plates as over them. No, that's confusing. Silence your growl. I ripped that out several times. I still like it. I get that again. Um, I'm gonna rip out Scoob right here the new movie haven't seen it yet I'm waiting for that to come out Jackson I wanted to see that on his birthday but COVID obviously stepped into play healthy eating on a budget tear heat go ew micro microwavable tuna oh god moving on gag me I don't even want to go there. Okay, some cute dogs. Um, oh my gosh, look at this dog. I'm gonna have to fussy cut that dog out. Ready, set, organize. Ooh, I love all this organization. Oh, I'm gonna cut this out. Wait, because I cut the dog. Let me look through my window. Oh, it does. Hmm, 
I might have to cut this out instead. It says it's cool to be kind. I like that a lot. Hmm. Night quill for pain. Maybe I should get me some of that. Ooh, silence. I want that. Oh no. It's on the other side. Not much. A little love when it's needed. Well, that sucks that I just ripped that. This is cute. All these little messages. I will rip that out. Oh, this is cute. Bringing back the art of letter writing and the importance of etiquette. She wrote a book and she has a stationary design shop named after her imaginary childhood friend, Rebecca, shares her creative must-haves and the benefits of putting pen to paper. I've always been a pencil person. I have gobs of number two yellow pencils throughout my life. What is even more essential is my metal Boston pencil sharpener. Remember those from back in the day? I'm going to cut this out, and I want this little record player. Oh, and I want these. Fun! And last but not least, the cow that I've cut out a million times. I might cut it out again. Okay, I'm going to. Cow's just like speaking to me. Like, hey, Nicole, cut me out, but don't eat me. Will do. Okay, well, geez, this is all that's left, and I'll, I'll go through it again, but holy moly, let's grab all of this. Look at all these pages. Granted, sometimes there's just one word that I want. I don't just rip out the little tiny piece that I want because oftentimes either I'll accidentally rip it or I'll lose it in the mix because it's smaller than the rest of the pages. So I just take out the full page and then relook at it. Oh my gosh, these pads, I'm telling you. So, wow. I think I have over half of the magazine. Look at all this, crazy. So I will have to say that this was a success, success successful that you ever have a word that just sounds weird all of a sudden that sounded weird to me um magazine harvest thanks for hanging out with me while i ripped through this magazine i hope you guys are having a great day and i will see you in the next video bye